डेवलपमेंट क्लाइमेट सिक्योरिटी एंड हेल्थ केयर इक्वली नीड टू कीप एन आई ऑन द राइज ऑफ डिस्ट्रक्टिव टेक्नोलॉजीज एंड बी प्रिपेयर टू लिवरेज दैम फॉर ग्रोथ वी नीड टू क्लियर एस एस द चैलेंजेज एंड ऑपरचुनिटीज फॉर अवर टेक्नोलॉजी रेडीनेस एंड कॉम्पिटिटिवनेस आई विन टोल that the technology vision 2035 document released in last year science congress is now developing into a detailed road map for 12 key technology sectors further niti aayog is evolving a holistic science and technology vision for the country one important area that needs to be addressed in the rapid global rise of cyber physical systems this has the potential to pose unprecedented challenges and stresses to our demographic dividend but we can trust it is a huge opportunity by research training and skilling in robotics artificial intelligence digital manufacturing big data analysis deep learning quantum communication and internet of things there is a need to develop and exploit this technology in services and in manufacturing sectors in agriculture water energy traffic management health and environment infrastructure and geo information system security financial systems and in commodity crime we need to develop an interministerial national mission in the cyber physical system to secure our future by creation of basic r&d infrastructure manpower and skills distinguished ladies and gentlemen the oceans that surround the indian peninsula a over 1300 of our islands they also give us a 7 and 1/2 thousand kilometer coastline and 2.4 million square kilometers of exclusive economic zone they contain enormous opportunities in energy food medicine and a host of other natural resources the ocean economy could be a significant dimension of our sustainable future i am told that the ministry of earth sciences is working to launch a deep ocean mission to explore understand and harvest these resources in a responsible way this could be a transformative step for the prosperity and security of the nation distinguished delegates our best science and technology institutions should further strengthen that basic research in line with leading global standards translating this basic knowledge into innovations startups and industry will help us achieve inclusive and sustainable growth scopus database indicates that india now ranks 6th in the world with respect to scientific publications 
growing at a rate of about 14 percent, as against the world average growth rate of about 4 percent. I'm sure that our scientists will further meet the challenges of enhanced quality of basic research, its technology translation, and its connect with society. By 2030, India will be among the top three countries in science and technology and will be among the most attractive destinations for the best talent in the world. The wheels we set in motion today will achieve this goal. Distinguished delegates, science must meet the rising aspirations of our people. India fully appreciates the strong role science and technology plays in meeting the societal needs. We must address the problems of urban-rural divide and work for inclusive development 